hello everyone and for today I will show you how you can patch your Windows 10 version 1903 to enable custom themes okay I will start with my version of Windows to see what version of Windows do you have simply hold the Windows button and press R on your keyboard and here type this click OK and here you will see that my version is 1903 and also you can see my build number okay uh, and now before you patch or install any of the custom themes you need to make a restore point it's very good because it some things go wrong so we can restore your windows so in search type restore and here open the create a restore point okay choose your drive and then click create name the file custom team win 10 click create okay now it will take a few seconds to create a restore point you can find all download links in the description below of this video so I will put each link for each application okay the restore point is created that's good I will close this okay now let's patch the windows what you need to patch the windows you need team signature bypass ultra UX team patcher old new explorer and start is back okay I will start with team signature bypass and if I if I don't find the link for team signature bypass but I will find it uh, you have it here on this site virtual customs uh, you can download many custom themes and many application to tweak windows so and here is the team signature bypass link just click on this and save the file for the ultra UX team patcher just go to the link in the description below here is the download link version 362 okay and do the same with all the new explorer and start is back like I said I will put each download link for each application so you can easily find it and let's start with team signature bypass okay I have already this on my computer but I will show you anyway go next accept next and here do not change the location of the folder just go next click install and that's it uh, like you see I have already this folder so I will click no okay go to the ultra UX team patcher uh, you will need to run this as administrator okay go next accept next I agreed and here my status is patched so here you will click install you need to restart your computer and then you can go back to this video and like you say use at your own risk it might damage your system but I have already do this and it's everything fine and I have done this many times on my Windows so but that is why I created the restore point okay here we have old new Explorer uh, you need to have this so just copy this folder and keep it somewhere on your on your computer uh, I'm keeping it on the downloads
so here's the downloads folder folder where I have this old new explorer you you can put this folder on desktop or whatever you want but I have it here and here you have application run this as administrator click yes and what you need to do okay I will uncheck this uh, check this first box and uncheck the last one so here leave the default style Windows 7 style and then click install okay like you see I have it already and click install so leave the same setup as me okay and the last one is start is back uh, if you want to have taskbar and start menu from the custom team you need to install start is back or if you want you can leave the default Windows 10 start menu so here's the start is back it's easy to install it go to the properties and from here you have start menu options appearance and that is what you will see later switching advanced and also you can choose this custom start button okay when you install all of this application you can download the HUD evolution uh, to download HUD evolution like I say you need to make account on virtual custom but this is not only site where you can download a custom team you can download any custom team from the internet but it must be for this version 1903 so here's the link download it after you download it just go to extract to HUD evolution folder and I have it and here uh, before you apply this team go to the extras and here uh, you will have already some application that you will need like all new explorer I don't know start is back but what we need to do for this team we need to go to disable immersive context menu and go to this one disable immersive context menu right click click merge click yes click yes again okay go back then go to the fonts select them all okay I'm holding my control button on keyboard and I'm selecting each font right click and click install I have do this already then go to the system metrics and for this you need to apply system metrics right click merge click yes click yes click ok and that's it uh, here you have a system transparency okay and here's a team copy this and go to the team's shortcut and if you want to know the location of the team folder here is here it is local disk C Windows resources teams and just paste it here and after you do this just go to the personalize go to the teams and you should see HUD evolution click on that okay here's the team one of the my most favorite teams for the windows okay like you see some of the images are not shown on start menu but for that go to the properties go to appearance and that is what you need to install start is back without start is back you will not have a custom taskbar and start menu look click apply and here is the custom start menu and for custom start button uh, you will not see this blue button here which I will apply right now uh, to install or add custom start button just go to this green little plus then go to the 
of course the location of the your custom start button image and this time is in the team folder start orbs select one of these click open and choose it from this click apply click ok and that's it you have it okay and that's how you can install the custom theme on the Windows 10 version 1903 uh, this theme is only working for this version do not apply this theme for older version of the Windows so uh, do the same with themes that are made for let's say version 1803 will not work on this version so you need to be you need to be very careful about that so you may damage your system if you install theme from version 1803 to this version so it happens to me maybe two or three times that I have damaged my system by doing that or just simply I install the theme that is not working for Windows and that's how you can damage your system so you need to know what are you doing with this and it will be all fine so that's it we have done the tutorial to select Windows 10 theme just go to the themes again and select the Windows theme of course and that's it okay we are back to the Windows 10 default team and that's it I really hope that I helped you so thank you for watching and see you next time and don't forget that every link is in description below of this video bye